What's going on guys? Welcome back to Voltage TV and today I'm going to be reviewing the brand new Gear VR 2. Now today I'm going to be talking about different aspects like comfortability, differences between this year's model and last year's model, and you know, like other key aspects. Alright, first off I'm going to be talking about comfortability. Now I, do, I don't have my phone in the headsets right now so it's going to be a little bit of a difference. So, um... When you put first put on the headset, you can tell there's a lot more um, cushioning around the um, facial area, like by your forehead and um, closer to your nose. Now, last year's model, my nose would always be sore, and my forehead would always um, have marks on it, and I'd get a headache after using this, after using it. But I feel like I could wear this for um, a little bit, not too much longer, but a little bit longer than I could the previous model. Alright, the next thing I want to talk about is the different features. Now, the features I'm going to be talking about today are the field of view, the weight, and the different um, USB connectors um, for the different phones. Now, these two are only for the um, Galaxy Note 7 that will be coming out, I don't know when, but these are, this is only used for the Note 7. Now, the first, I want to talk about the um, field of view. The field of view is um, slightly bigger than last year's model. It's 110 degrees. Uh, I'm not sure how how much it was on the previous model. You can always go look that up if you want to know exactly how much it was. And then the um, the weight. It is a lot lighter than the previous headset. I believe it is. A, um, I don't remember. I think it was a couple grams lighter than the previous headset. And if you you can tell once you put once you pop your phone in and then you put it on your head you can tell there is a um, bigger weight difference between the two. And then the last thing I want to talk about is the um, the um, protector for the um, headset itself. Now in last year's model, you know you would just um, you would put your phone into the headset and then you're you kind of be um, all ready to go. But with this year's model. You cannot put your, you cannot put your um, the cover over your phone. You want to know why? Because you see this um little slot right here, that indicates that's where the USB goes, and there's no way for the USB to go into your phone while um using the headset. So the cover is mainly for um protecting the lenses, which is really important. So I see why they did that. Why they did that there, but I'm just curious why they wouldn't allow you to use the with the cover I'm sorry they would not allow you to use your um, headset and use the cover at the same time which is kinda odd to me but to me it really doesn't make a difference I still get to <laughs> use a virtual reality headset without paying six hundred or eight hundred dollars and you know all that other good stuff the next topic I'm gonna be talking about is should you upgrade from last year's model to this year's model? Now it's really hard to say because last year and this year there's really no there isn't really much of a difference except the f the field of view and the two USB connectors. So if you are going to be um, getting the Note 7, I you on, their only choice is to get the new headset. But if you have an um, Samsung S6 like me and um, you're looking into buying um, the Gear VR. Now they still sell the old model. They still sell last year's model at um, it is seventy four dollars on Best Buy right now. You can look at it. This one's selling for a hundred. Now if you're on a budget, go for the la go for last year's model. But if you want all the um, which there's many new features. But if you want the increased field of view, you want the more comfortable headset. And you're gonna be if you know exactly you're gonna be uh, upgrading to the Note 7 or one of the newer phones, and I suggest shooting for this headset. But if you don't plan on upgrading your phone and you want a um and you want the Gear VR, then go for last year's model. The only the thing I really like about this new headset is the um, the color. Of course, who won't love this color? Um, and the new the home they have the integrated just to take you home button and then the back button and then you got your volume buttons so there isn't really much of a difference between last year's headset and this year's headset 
except you know you get to use the new adapters and then I keep saying that I've said this at least three times the increased field of view but if you have this headset if you have the last year's model of this headset stick with it the only reason I have this the new model is because my um, previous model wasn't working and I decided you know that I would just get this my I would just get the brand new model and you know there isn't really much of a difference between the um, two headsets so if you have one stick with it if you want the new one it's a hundred dollars go for it but in my opinion just stick with what you have all right I hope you guys enjoyed this video um be sure to like and subscribe peace